Rachel Amber. Chase rule. So I gotta go into a twenty one. Did you think you were best friends forever or something? Twenty one. You might as well be you. Caulfield. So I have to. It's a giant deer! No, that's a giant This one is for Samuel. Okay. I have to. To my room. It will off and I go on later. Oops, I'm sick. She's so fucking shy, she takes selfies with a giant camera. You didn't tell me how cute I looked yet. I need a serious time out in the bathroom. Nigga, bro, man, I have to look like a total loser. Then, I'm going to do a special picture of why would anybody want to carry around a dorky Instamatic? Welcome to the real world. Because Max wants everybody to see how hip she is. Don't try to hide, Max! Get over here! Let me capture you! Jefferson is coming after me again. Max! No. You used to be so pure, so innocent. Now, you have to die. Please understand, Max. The only place I can... Max! Max, don't fuck around! Rewind! Please understand, Max. The only... Place I can be myself, Max. Please understand, Max. The only place I can be myself is in the dark room. I can't believe you let that hillbilly murder me in cold blood. What? happened to your spark, Max. I thought I could be your professor for life. I realize now you'll never be an artist, much less a photographer. Come here, Max. Class is dismissed. 
Nice. Max. Max. I miss those days. Max. I miss those days when you looked at me in class with those wide eyes. I want to be your professor again. I can teach you so much. Good evening, Blackwell. This is Principal Wells. And I'm here, Max. Web. Good evening, Miss Coffee. Come out to play. Come out to play. Hey, babe, babe. Who wants to go, ape? Go, ape, go, ape, babe, babe. Get in the car! Blow this whole Come. Hold on, Max. I wish I could press a button and blow this whole fucking school up. Hey, Max. Pretty fucking ironic that I ended up being right about everything, and you end up destroying the town! Holy shit! You really think Victoria's gonna be your best hey, friend forever? Ha! Please, she will here. always hate you! So I can beat you up! Max? Max? Victoria's gonna- Max! Everything, and you end up- Get your bony ass over here. You open, freak. Hey, Max. Nope. Hey. Oh, man. You should have heard Chloe smack if talk. Only you could have hey, seen Rachel. Maybe you might be a lot happier. Hey! Oh. Oh. Stop! Hilarious. Max, you need to get high like Rachel. Want some drugs? Hey, Max! Holy fucking shit, Max. That was hilarious. Max, you need to get high like Rachel. Want some drugs? Oh, God. That was... That was an adventure. Um. Don't you dare question the chef. Right, like you're the real cook here? I am when your mom is away. I'll let her know that. Um. Hello? Hey, honey. Just making a fabulous breakfast with Chloe and Max. We're all going to work at the two wind. What? Oh, I didn't know you had to get groceries. Of course I'll come make you look. Now I'll have an excuse to get a mocha. Be there shortly. Love you. Come on, little otter. We can make it through this. I have to go rescue yonder queen at the safe mart. She don't have many bags of delicious grub for us you to You are ridiculous. Upon. You'll be grateful for that someday. Shit, where are my keys? That's a dollar for the swear jar. You mean your college fund? Keys, please. Yeah, 
Where are those keys? Another dollar for the square jar. You're bankrupting me. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. You can't hide from me forever. Now lock up after I leave. Play nice. Try not to destroy too much of the house. And no Chloe and Max want. How long will this nightmare go on? I think you'd be perfect for my new photo series on retro grunge. You have the same qualities that I loved in Rachel Amber, but not Max. Max is a fucking child. Oh Christ, I know. And she never shuts up, does she? I'm so over her hipster bullshit. Uh, um. I think everyone at Blackwell is over Max. Let's prove it. Booyah, Warren. I thought you were all over Max's shit. Not after she kissed me. Her breath was ass and no tongue. I hear that. I'm not into nerds, but you're pretty cute. I'm not into Max anyway. So let's bust a move. God damn, you are a sexy bitch. Why hang out with Max, huh? Boredom. Plus, she's like my personal puppet. I uh, hear that. <laughs> Do you want a party? I got a drugstore in my room. Oh, shit. Look at Max spying on us. Take a fucking picture, bitch. Or take a selfie. See, this is how you bust a move, Max. No mosh pit for you, shaka bra. Damn, Victoria. You're a real woman. Not a little girl like Max. I you fucking can... love your tats, Chloe. You're so hot. That, yeah, they can... I can't believe it took us so long to hook up. They can hook up, I don't even care. I just stare at myself. Why did you get rewind powers? You don't even know how to use them. Rachel's dead and you're still alive? Life is so not fair. Shit, I wish you would've up, never Chloe. come back to Arcadia Bay. You're the real storm. Oh god. So I'm stuck in a loop where everything hates me. Great. Numbers are all over the place. How will I find the right code? It should be the same code for the... thing. What was it? Again. What was it again? Ah. This is This is kind of like that game, um what's that game? Like oh, like horror game where you have to like do those clues and stuff. Don't kill us, Max. I guess I'll never dance again, Max. Right when I was about to start a new life in California. I can't believe you 
Always so this is how like Max dollars. gets her revenge? Breaker, breaker. Kill me? Me? Thanks for saving me. Don't let the squirrels, the squirrels die. die. We'll have to go without me. Don't That's let the squirrels even die. Even if I'm dead. How can you let Please, all these Max, other people kill me? Who, who are you? Holy shit, are you cereal? I'm you, dumbass. Or I'm one of many Maxes you've left behind. Can you get me out of here? Oh, so you want help? Oh, uh, <laughs> Thought you could control everybody and everything, huh? Twist time around your fingers? I tried to help. I only wanted to do the right thing. No, you only wanted to be popular. And once you got these amazing powers, your big plan was to trick people into thinking you'd give a rat's ass. I do care. That's why I was trying to make friends. By telling people what they want to hear? You were just looking for a shortcut because you can't make friends on your own. That's uh, not true. Shut up. I have great friends and I've used my powers for good. Please stop playing innocent. You're a goddamn hypocrite. You've left a trail of death and suffering behind you. That was not my fault, you son of a bitch. Don't you dare talk about our mom that way. <laughs> what about the crap that was your fault? Wait, wait, let me guess. You fucked up time and space for your precious punk, Chloe? <laughs> you think she's worth all that? We all are. This isn't about Chloe. Or even me anymore. Gosh, you're so selfless now, Mahatma Max. It's too bad you pissed your power away on high school drama. Chloe does a better job of guilt tripping me than you do. Because you let her bully you. It's called Stockholm Syndrome. Actually, yeah, that... But you didn't do I that can... homework. So you have to learn the hard way. Like Rachel. Just shut up. You're not scaring me anymore. I'd be more worried about Chloe killing us than Jefferson. Max, do you really think she's our friend? That she respects us in any way? Man, you are so stupid. <laughs> I'm embarrassed to have the same name. And someday Chloe will destroy... Oh hell, speak of the devil. Dude, do not even fuck with her head. She knows what we went through together this week, and you don't. There's no way you can break up our team. This is reality. After five years, you're still Max Caulfield. I am seriously glad to see you. Welcome home, Max. Fasten your seatbelt. I, uh, know it was your birthday last month. This song fucking rules. Can't dance, hippie? Come on! You were here today, Max. You saved me. I'm still tripping on that. Seeing you after all these years feels like... Destiny. Let's talk about your superpower. Epic! Welcome to American Rust. My home away from hell. You saved me again. Crazy. Now we're totally bonded for life. I'm so glad you're my partner in crime. Max, you better come check out these files. Cowabunga! Let's call it a draw. I'm gonna freeze- Photo bomb! Photo. I double dare you. Kiss me now. Sorry. Oh, we could cruise everywhere in this bad boy. Can you see us heading? Not until I see it first. You know the rules, Dad. It's weird hanging out with you again. I know. Wow, awesome picture. But Chloe, you're back. Kate wasn't the first. Rachel. No, Rachel, no, no, please, not her. Come on, Max, we're almost there. Almost there. Come on. Max. Don't worry, don't worry. We'll be okay. That was a awesome trip. Max, Max, can you hear me? Please say something. Chloe? No. I, I must have passed out. Oh, thank God. Don't you ever do that again, okay? I swear. But that nightmare was so real. It was so horrible. This is 
my storm. I caused this. I caused all of this. I changed Max's storm. So I actually did alter the course of everything. And all I really created was just death and destruction. Fuck all of that, okay? You were given a power. You didn't ask for it. And you saved me. Which had to happen. All of this did. Except for what happened to Rachel. But without your power, we wouldn't have found her. Okay, so you're not the goddamn Time Master, but you're Maxine Caulfield. And you're amazing. Max's storm. Well... Storm this thing together. Max. This is the only way. I, I feel it. like I took the shot a thousand years ago. You. You could use that photo to change everything right back to when you took that picture. All that would take is for me to. To fuck that. No, no way. Um, you are my number one priority. Now. Can I change oh, that? I don't. I don't want to save Chloe. I'd rather you save the that town. Over and over again, even though I don't deserve it. Yeah, you're not Madoka. So selfish. We're not Homura. No, We're not gonna play this. Look what she had to give up and live through, and she did. She deserves so much more than to be killed by a storm in a fucking diner. Even my my stepfather deserves her alive. There's so many more people in Arcadia Bay who should live. Way more than me. Yeah, Stay Chloe. I won't I'm not gonna save Chloe. You're not trading me. Maybe you've just been delaying my real destiny. Look at how many times I've almost died or actually died around you. Look at what's happened in Arcadia Bay ever since you first saved me. I know I've been selfish, but for once, I think I should accept my fate. Our fate. Chloe. Okay, bye, Chloe. Max, you finally came back to me this week, and you did nothing but show me your love and friendship. You made me smile and laugh like I haven't done in years. You're still Wherever a bad person. In whatever reality, all those moments between us were real. And they'll always be ours. Bye. No matter what you choose, I know you'll make the right decision. Chloe, I can't make this choice. No, Max. You're the only one who can. gonna sacrifice Arcadia Bay like bye I'm not gonna sacrifice Arcadia Bay there's too many people here that deserve life way more than Chloe like like I'm not gonna sacrifice Arcadia Bay for her I don't even know her it's time Chloe I'm so so sorry I, I don't want to do this. I know, Max. But we have to. We have to save everybody. Okay? And you'll make those fuckers pay for what they did to Rachel. Yeah, I did. I don't care for her. Being together this week. It was the best farewell gift I could have hoped for. You're my hero, Max. Oh, Chloe. I'm gonna miss you so much. Like, I don't understand why people. I don't understand. I always love you. Now get out of here, please. Do it before I freak. And Max Caulfield, don't you forget about me. Never. Don't you. Forget about me. Don't, 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 don't you forget about me. I 
have to. I mean, like... <sighs> the only thing that Chloe really gave me were those memories for her. I can't... Chloe's not coming in. Nathan's not coming in. Oh, never mind. I lied. They're coming in now. It's cool, Nathan. <laughs> Don't stress. You, you're okay, bro. Just count to three. Don't be scared. You own this school. If I wanted, I could blow it up. <laughs> you're the boss. You could blow it up, Nathan. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step-ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. You don't know who the fuck I am, or who you're messing around with! Where'd you get that? What are you doing? Come on, put that thing down! Don't ever tell me what to do! I'm so sick of people trying to control well, like me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Chloe Nobody is not a good person. Miss your punk ass, would they? Like get that gun away from me, psycho! Think of all the people Chloe would have just shot and killed without any moment of like grief. The only person she really cared about was me, Rachel, and her mom and her dad. There's like no one else she really cared for. Everyone else in this game showed like some um, other amount of caring for other people nathan sat there and redeemed himself chloe like she never really redeemed herself she was just like oh whatever it's my life save me blah blah, blah. It, it was always about chloe and i can't stand stuff that's like you have to have your life around like surrounds yourself around this thing like chloe seemed to have no remorse for anything she did ever she was just she was just always angry and she couldn't just let go of that anger and i just can't deal with that i don't i'm not that type of person where i redeem like
this dog it's so cute well the thing is it's like chloe all she did was hang on to her anger her grief and nothing everybody else showed remorse for any of their actions chloe never felt remorse until the very end whenever she realized oh shit the storm's for me all these other characters if you sat there and you talked to them they they weren't bad people Chloe bad people. <laughs> like, I said this at the very beginning of the game. I don't like Chloe from the way she was acting. And people are like, oh, you're gonna like her. You're gonna like her. You're gonna like her. And I thought, you know, maybe I'd like her, but she just didn't, she didn't change. She didn't. All I did was keep going back and back in time because Chloe, was supposed to make sense to me and I was supposed to save Chloe but there was no reason for me to like want to save Chloe other than she was like supposedly my best friend but she had no aspects of somebody that I would actually want to save like a she wanted me not to pick up the phone for Kate that was the only thing she felt actual remorse about because I saved Kate. She All she cared about was Rachel Amber and that's all she kept wanting me to do my rewind powers for instead of, you know, actually trying to make their life better. Like, she just couldn't let go of her grief and her anger which was ultimately her undoing and it's just everybody else in the town like look at Dana look at Juliet look at everybody else <laughs> they actually did the backwards thing of it okay so like that's the thing it's like how am I supposed to sacrifice a ta an entire town of good people like Joyce and David and like Nathan didn't deserve what he got how was I supposed to sacrifice Kate how is I says how am I supposed to sacrifice these people like Kate Warren Joyce David how am I supposed to sacrifice them for this person who doesn't deserve this person who sat there and was just an entire angry and could not just let go it's there's a reason chloe needed to die they're like there is i'm sorry and i said that at the very beginning of the game where i was sitting there and i was like oh well you know there must be a reason chloe dies like so kate's a good person Kate's a good person. Kate is good fam. Like, she loves people. Kate loves people with her entire being. Even whenever she wanted to, like, whenever she did hold on to the hatred, Kate just wanted to le leave life because she didn't want to hold on to it. She loved people and she wants to make everybody's lives better through her own pain. Chloe wants to make everybody's lives worse because she's in pain. Like, I can't, I can't. 
like, I can't sacrifice for that. Like, I can't. I can't sacrifice an entire town of good people for Chloe, who ultimately just didn't even want me to live my own life. Max, who was supposedly her best friend. Chloe didn't even want Max to live her own life. How am I supposed to like Chloe? I don't care. I really honestly don't care. I still pretty sure I made the ultimate choice and I'm sitting here and I'm like, if I play this game 10,000 times, I'll probably keep making the same choice. Because how it's like It's like that choice of, am I going to give up? Like, I'm not in love with Chloe. That's the problem. It's like, I am not in love with her. The game did not make me fall in love with Chloe. It was just, I can't. I can't fall in love with Chloe. And the game is supposed to make you, depending on which one you choose, it's ultimately, hey, Blazeword. It's ultimately, did you fall in love with Chloe? Okay, I'm gonna let this in right here, right now. Even if someone wanted to do suicide, that does not mean they're a bad person and you should actually let them die. It does not mean any of that. Okay? No. Just no. And if you believe that, I can't be around you, and you should probably not be anywhere near my stream. Because... That's the point. If you love Chloe, you just choose her in the end. Yeah, that's the entire point. And I, the game just did not make me fall in love with her. I didn't. I don't love Chloe. Because it's like that ultimate choice of, will you give up everything for this one person? Would you give up everything for this one person? Or will you... See, I'm not even... I'm not even... I'm not even in the... Like, I'm in the majority. Friends? Friends, I am in the majority. I'm in the majority. Hello, friend. Hello. The thing is, like, Max is me. Like, whenever I played through me, like, whenever I played through me, because, like, I pretty much have the same personality as basically Max whenever you do the choices. I chose through me. This game is supposed to show you who you are as a person. And that's who I am as a person. I can't... Oh, I should have done that. Okay, David got a scar during the fight. Okay. How are you supposed to not get a scar? Okay. I'm a pansexual, so I do like women as well. Are you sure? Are you sure, friend? Are you sure? Because I'm pretty sure I still made the right choice. I saved Aaron, saved the trucker. Oh, I forgot to save Alyssa. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, well. Oosh, I should have saved Lissa. Okay. Just talk. Right? But it's like I'm a pansexual, so I do like women. I just don't like Chloe. So it's not even if you're a lesbian or not. It's if you're... If you like Chloe or not. Because I know plenty of my friends that are, like, lesbian that would not choose Chloe. Because they're like, uh, Chloe bad person. So, 
for Life is Strange. Strange. And that's the end.